What's up everyone, this is Ken. I am back with another video. I wanted to just do a video. It's uh, really not in any kind of order. Just kind of testing the system. I do now have 10.69.2. Took about three months to get it. And also I wanted to just go over and I hope I get a red light up here just to see how well the car stops when it is on a highway so we got a red light coming up up here and this is gonna be just my first test to see if it's any kind of different all right we're gonna see here so I can already tell immediately that it's start it starts regenerative braking a little bit before which is a good thing and it's a very slow and easy stop right there and one thing you'll notice you probably won't see it in this video they did change the indicator that shows the regenerative braking and when it's using braking I guess I mean I don't know if that's in every car or not like I said I've been stuck on 20.22.12 for three months and now we're on 20.22.28 I definitely want to explore a uh, unprotected left hand turn as well so we'll probably jump to that all right so we're going to try our unprotected left off of a highway and traffic is going very fast there are cars coming from this way all right stop 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 all right so it is stopped so we got it coming from both directions here Still got cars coming from this way as well. But this side is clear. Let's see what it's gonna do. So it's waiting for these cars. This side is still good over here. It's got his butt out there. So what I'm gonna do is take it out because you shouldn't do that, okay? Definitely shouldn't do that, so. But, I mean, it did pretty well as far as not going in front of anybody, right? But maybe the Chuck Cook is um, tailored for medians? I wish it would have just got in the, the center line. That would have been nice. I'll try to find somewhere else where we can try to do it. That was a good amount of little traffic there. All right. I might have somebody behind me on this one though, coming from a gas station. But I'm gonna go down here and I'm gonna turn around and I'll be right back. Okay, why are you going that way? Yeah. Okay. There's some trees, some shrubbery. There is a car turning. Stop, stop. So this side is good. There's a couple over there. All right, so after this car, it should go. This side is clear. Hey, not bad. It's not getting up as fast as I wanted to, but that wasn't too bad. So what I take from this, is with the Chuck Cook, maybe um, it was more focused on having the median, you know, as protection where it can just sit in there, right? So, um, also, I wish it would, when you don't have the median, it will, once the left side is clear, it'll just get in that left, in that middle section and wait until the right side has been clear not too bad but um, I'm sure they'll work on that um, you know here in the future so I'm just seeing what it's gonna do when there whenever there's just you know a wide open lane the traffic is going like 55 to 60 miles per hour all right so there's cars coming this way there's only one over here 
but it does have a creep limit and it's pretty comfortable but it's going up a little bit it's utilizing that little creep limit still cars the right side is good to go it should go now not bad so without a median something you know where it can sit in which it I mean it should be able to sit in the center line right um, it's just probably not programmed for that yet um, if the traffic is clear it does so much better than 10.12.2 so 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 much better all right so there it does have a uh, speed limit sign reduced here let's see if it'll read that and it should of course it saw it it did reduce it it just takes forever for um, FSD to slow down like I've made a video like that I'll put that video somewhere in the description all right so we'll see how it handles there's nobody behind me at all so let's see how quick it will recognize this and see if it'll freak out so I got my hand on the wheel here it's a truck in the middle so it does see them and then it slammed on this brakes okay well this turned out to be something else see it sees them coming up so it slammed on brakes a little bit again it's telling me turn on the wheel I don't know there's nobody behind me so that's why I'm letting it do whatever it needs to do hey Tesla person see like I've seen on some videos it's trying to any kind of break in those construction things it wants to go so it's gonna come to a complete stop so construction zones it definitely needs work okay are you gonna stay in the middle lane what are you gonna do come on what are you gonna do come on dude all right I'm giving it acceleration there so yes definitely need a little bit of work on that and it's oh it's still reading for 50 uh, 35 miles per hour because there's no sign or anything to get it back up like a speed limit 55 sign so it still think it's like 35 so that freaked it out there that really freaked it out huh okay but it's gonna be kind of like a little sharp turn and then it should stop it should do the creep and then we'll see how it goes shouldn't be that much traffic I believe still almost comes to a complete stop but it is a whole lot better than 10.12.2 all right all right middle lane there you go get that down it's no left is good the right it, it can go As you can kind of see it I mean it did good it kind of went over that yellow line but it did pretty good it didn't really have to stop okay so we're now we're gonna go to the next one I'll be right back okay so it's gonna be like the side street from this road and we're gonna try to go across now this is an unmarked road let's see how well if it keeps in its lane so I'm gonna start it nice and it jumps right into the middle and there is a car coming it can see the car or the truck the truck is turning but it's just <laughs> I don't know you'll probably see 10.12.2 uh, I did record that to see if it's about the same but even with that truck turning it still is maintaining the middle but you're gonna see this really sharp turn here coming up hopefully you can see it on the display because we got the Sun it's going down a little bit and it's gonna take a left turn all right well it got lucky no cars no cars at all I saw some type of blue line there there is a car that was coming up but I mean it was too far back now we're gonna just try this last one. Take a left up here and then um, on my way back, 
I'll let you see how it does. I don't expect any any kind of traffic whatsoever. So that's my luck. Be right back. Let's throw it on here. Oh, got a biker here. It's projecting to go around her. Okay. It's still kind of getting in the middle. If somebody's turning, I mean, it's just not. There's no. There is the creep limit there. There's a car way down there, but you can't see it. Okay. Man. Sorry about that. Sun is setting. Hopefully you can see the screen. And there's some cars coming, but... There's two cars turning in. Pull that down. There's no cars, but it does put it up there if you can see that. Oh, it takes off. It takes off. Oh. We'll go up here. I'll show you right now where up here, unprotected left at this red light, it eases into the lane too much. And it can see the car is coming from the other side. Hopefully nobody turns in this turning lane so I can like let you know, well, of course. It, never fails and there's no cars coming so I can't really predict it but you did see what I'm saying look how the wheel look how good not a lot of jitter up oh, I don't know what that is so there's still I don't know what it's seeing and it's taking forever to get back up to 40 it's just taking its time so there are some things they need to work out um, some regressions um, every new version of course have it you know it changes uh, no complaints here uh, thank you for looking at this video um, definitely hit that like button and that subscribe button if you see fit and hit that notification bell so you can see more fsd beta videos uh, in the future uh, this is youtube ken see you in the next video